Hello, I'm Roxy Andrews and I'm here to make it clear. <laughs> my name is Cass, aka um, Hylian Babe. This is my cloud cut crease tutorial. I tried to do a talk through, didn't work because I'm too awkward and I'm also really bad at explaining stuff. So, um, I tried. I'm so but yeah, I'm sorry that this even this intro is awkward and a lot of ums. Let's just tell you. So let's get to the video. So just start to like carve out the cloud. She's not cute. It's fine. So since I'm using multiple colors, I'm just going to do one part pink, and then I'm going to start another one, but just do half with the pink. I'm going to try to stay here. And if it's like not perfect, it's fine. Oh, it is not gonna be a cute cloud, but whatever. Monster! Can you see her? <laughs> no barking! I give up. I just go in with Gonzo from the Urban Decay Electric palette because look at like the other ones show up fine. This one doesn't show up that well, unfortunately. start to blend. So here I get quiet and I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm just taking poison plum and blending that out. And here, I'm just taking the blue shade and blending that out as well. So since I decided to get quiet in the middle of this tutorial, um, how are you guys? You guys doing good? Did you eat your favorite food today? I haven't. I really want Cheez-Its. Okay, so I like to cut the crease starting at the top of the cloud. Uh, just use a concealer of your choice and like a flat, really dense brush and just start to carve out the edges first. You can pretty much add the concealer or cut the crease however you want. I just like to start from the edges and then blend inward. Um, I'm pretty sure that's how you do a cut crease, but I'm pretty new at this, so that's how I did it. So once you're done cutting your crease with concealer, um, I like to make it white like a cloud and I use the best white eyeshadow <laughs> ever and that's gonna be Sugar Pills Taco Shadow. I just use like a stubby brush to pack that on and just be super careful not to get that blended in with the colors that you added around it. So 
starting with the waterline, um, I'm going in with Poison Plum again and just adding that to the middle um, just because that one's the most pigmented color that I'm using. It'd be easier to blend the other ones in. Now I'm just lining my eyes. Like I said in a previous video, I don't like to do a wing. Um, I just like to add a semi-thin line just so my thick band of my eyelashes that I usually wear just blend in easier. There's no gap. Now I'm just applying my lashes. Y'all already know Slayer by Rouge and Rogue are my babies. So yeah, this is the final look and me fixing my eyelashes, feeling my oats. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this look.